Okay, good morning everybody. It's March 14th, 2019, and I'm going to do an update of my rolling pan project. I did pretty good. I have three empties. Actually four, but I, f I can't find the uh, fourth one. But um, I had two of these samples of lipstick from uh, Yves Raccoeur. It's the mail order uh, makeup line, skincare line. And I emptied two of these. So that was the first thing. And I rolled in another lipstick and then rolled it right back out because I realized it was had gone bad. So I also used up L'Oreal Color Rich uh, Lip Liner, the shade. And you can see it's gone. Ta-da! Yay! Um, I don't know what color this was, but it was lovely. It was like a nude on me. So, I was happy about that. And uh, I used up this travel size of Ben Nye Translucent Powder Fair. And it was, like, right there, and now it's gone. So, yay. So, that means I rolled in three products. Actually, I rolled in a lot more than three products. Um, I'm still working on my Maybelline Instant Lift Age, Re Age Reline, the lifter. Lala. It was down here. And now it's up here. So, after this video, I'm going to uh, mark it again. I'll probably finish this before a month. Before my next update. So, I'll show you something new then. I like this. It's, it's not a full coverage but uh you know right now my skin is pretty fine so it's it's not breaking out so it just evens out the tone i'm happy with it and to replace my ben nye i rolled this in and this was brand new when i uh dug it out of my uh Supply stash. Here you go. I'm gonna hide the mirror. There you go. And this is about. I have a nice little dip going in there. I think I've been using it for th two and a half weeks, but it's CoverGirl Clean Coverage Classic Ivory. I like it. It's working out okay. I got it on all over today. Actually, this makeup is from last night because I just got off work. And I realized I need... Concealer. And this is uh, CoverGirl. I can't read the name. Uh... Ready, set, gorgeous. La, la, la. And, again, I can't read. Don't go blind. But it's a fair shade, and it covers well, and I'm using it right now. So, it blends well. I'm happy with it. That there, too. Um... When I stopped, when I finished up those samples, I decided to try rolling in a Burt's Bees lipstick. I had bought this a long time ago, never used it. It was brand new when I started. And I think I've used about a fourth of an inch up because when I first started, 
And this is what I'm wearing now. When I first started, you could still see the lipstick at the very top. It actually hung out over. But uh, now it's about a fourth of an inch inside. So I'm doing well. Uh, this is in 523 Sunset Cruise. I like this color. I think it looks good on me. Um, but what I'm afraid is in the summertime, my lipsticks always melt. So I might have to roll this out and just roll in a lip gloss or a liquid lipstick because it's going to melt on me. St. Louis weather, high humidity, it's going to happen. So, but I'll keep using it until it gets too hot. Okay, e.l.f. This is my e.l.f. blush palette. They do not have names. This has been gone for a while. This was a uh, bronzer. I used it the contour. And this is where I'm at with this shade. I'm almost done. That's pretty darn cool. I'm excited. So, I'm going to finish, finish this up. And... I think I'm going to go to this one next because it'll be summertime. But I like this. It holds color pretty well. You know, it stays with you. Got another e.l.f. palette. This is Total Face Palette by e.l.f. Um, I think we got this I don't know. Did I get this in the Walgreens box when it came out? And I believe they never came out with another one. But this is a highlighter. I put it right here. And it works pretty well. It's not... And I put it on my nose. It's still there. So, I like it. it this is a good palette. It's, uh, I think, better for summer for me. I've been using this bronzer to contour with. It works pretty well. Um, and I've also been using this to blend up a little. I put my bronzer, my blush, and then this second blush right here. Right here. And then I put in the highlighter. And it's all blended together. It, it, it suits me well. Okay. My eyeliner. It's still going. What was this? Uh, L'Oreal. I think it was Blackish. That was the name of it. I've only ever saw this one. And that's it. So, I have never seen anybody talk about it. It has a really good point on it. I just lined my lower lashes with it. So, it still is going. I used it last night. It was, it's there. I've been using that for like four months. Okay. And since... I rolled, I actually rolled that uh, lip liner from L'Oreal out last night. I finished it up. And I rolled in this from Wet n Wild. Wet n Wild lip. And it's in Flirty Kiss. So here's this. I haven't even put this on my lips yet. So. Here you go. That's the shade. This is the kind of lip liner you actually have to, you know, use a uh, sharpener with. So, this is going to take a while. Get used to that one. Um, I also have been using Melania Make It Dewy Setting Spray. 16-hour um, wear. This is pretty freaking awesome. I've never used the setting spray before. But, uh, you know, after I get done with my makeup, I give it a couple of spray, 
I don't know if you're supposed to, supposed to, but I shake it. And then I give it a couple of spritz, you know, about a foot away. And it really does set my makeup. I love this stuff. This is, this is the keeper. I got a couple other setting sprays, but I think that's the only uh, one of M Melania, Melani, make it dewy. So, last week, I was on vacation, and I wasn't putting on a full face of makeup. So, I broke this out, and I've been using it quite a bit. This is, um, I believe it's a Japanese product, and it's, it's spelt... M-I-X-I-U. And it's in color four. Um, I had, I've had this for a while. It's a, uh, a lip tint. A stain. And I put it on. And it stays red all pretty much day. But before I put that on, I, uh, put this on. It's uh, L'Oreal's Nude Balm. This. Here you go. Someone just came in. And I like it. It, uh, it makes your lips very moisturized. And it helps keep that uh, lip stain on very well. So, that's that. If uh, you could, please like and subscribe to me because I would appreciate it. And have a lovely day. Wish me luck. I'm almost done with this. Bye.